a diagram from A to G, okay? Find the range of values for the shortest path from A to G to pass through D. Okay, now here's what I'm going to do. Without going through D, I'm going to explore my other options, all right? So uh, we'll have a go through D, D first, all right? And, and we'll see. Where's my thing? Oh, there we go. Okay, let's do this. A to B to D to G. Can we add all them up? So 80 plus 50 is 130. 130 plus 60 is? Okay, yeah, we agree 190 plus X for that route. Okay, then I refocus on other routes, like this one. How fast is that one? 180 plus 50 is 230 for the blue route. And then I'll focus on one other route. We'll go green. What do we reckon for that one? 250 minus X, okay. Is everybody happy to have the, the number for all three routes? Now, I want the yellow route to be the best. It has to be the best. Everybody got that? What does that mean? It has to be smaller than 230. What X value would cause that to be smaller than 230? Is everybody happy with X less than 40? Cool. Now, I also want this route to be smaller than 250 minus X. What does that mean? Anybody? 2x less than uh, 60 and then x less than 30. The x less than 30 sort of disregards the x less than 40. Doesn't matter anymore. So what are we going to say? 0, x can be 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 30. Okay, x has to be positive. Oh, positive, has to be positive. So therefore, can't equal zero, has to be less than zero. Yeah. Uh, find the range of values for which the shortest path from A to G passes through C. Passes through C is the green route. So what do we want to be the shortest route this time? We want the shortest route to be the 250 takeaway x this time. Is everybody all right with that? 250 takeaway x. So what we're going to do is we're going to do 250 take away X uh, less than 230 to begin. And that means uh, minus X less than minus 20. And then therefore I multiply both sides by minus 1. We've got X bigger than 20 for a start. Not the final answer now, but just as a, as a start. We also want 250 minus X, which is the green route. We want it to be shorter than the yellow route, which is 190 plus X. Once again, bring the X out to your side, minus 2X, less than minus 60. Multiply both sides by minus, divide both sides by minus 2. We've got X bigger than 30, and we get that. So we need the X value to be bigger than 30 for this. It disregards the, uh, that takes out the other answer. So it's just X is bigger than 30.